do I use the Control 4 interface on a touchscreen, tablet, or phone? Control 4 is organized into rooms. Right now, we are looking at the room screen for the living room. The living room is the room we controlled the last time we used the Control 4 app. These icons in the middle take you to the various experiences or services that you can control in this room. We will delve into each of these in subsequent videos. In addition to experience categories, like watch, listen, and lighting, you can customize your room screen by favoriting devices and media. I already favorited Netflix so that it shows up here so that I don't have to always go into the watch experience and tap it from there. We will talk about how to save a favorite in another video. After entering an experience, the home button will return you to the room screen. As you customize the room screen the way you like it, you might delete an experience because it is not used that often. When you do need to access that experience again, tap the Control 4 logo here to open up the room menu with all of the experiences available to this room. If you wish to control another room, tap the room name and we see a list of all the other controllable rooms. Check this out. If I tap the pencil, I can create favorite rooms by harding the ones I use the most, and then tap the check to save. When I go back to the room screen, I can now easily access my favorite rooms by swiping left or right. You can even see how many favorite rooms you have as indicated by the little boxes above the room name. And that's how you use the Control 4 interface.